welcome. This is Melissa Armel with the Stock Swoosh reviewing Nike. Nike was a Stock Swoosh show play of the day today. Was wild out of the gate. Actually required a retake. That is something that I review in the Golden Gap course. Um, but anyways, it worked out fabulously. So we did this as a day trade, and I also called a put in this too. Another great play. <clears throat> so when you, first of all, when you see a spike like this, I'll look at the one minute in a minute. It opened at 108.20, spiked it to 114.05. That's a machine, okay? You can really see it here in the one. It's just ridiculous. So we shorted this, got stopped, then it ran up, then we got back into it with a much tighter entry, actually, got the drop, got out of it fast, it kept going. Actually, I don't even know where this is gonna close today, the low, this could drift off and go lower even, we have another hour left, so. Um, but a beautiful move, a beautiful move today. And again, this kind of spike thing, you know, you, you got to put a stop in. So again, I use stops. It's a hard stop. It's a limit order stop. It stops you out. If you don't take the stop, I mean, again, this had a massive move up all the way up to 114. You know, if you don't put a stop in, you essentially have unlimited risk. And I don't trade like that. Even if I do an option, I have a fixed risk. And when you do a day trade again, I put the stop in. There's nothing wrong with taking the stop and then retaking it. When you get the confirmation it's gonna go, which we did and we got back into it, then you retake it. And then we made the money back from the first trade that lost, and then we made profit on top of that. And actually, again, you could still have held this a lot longer than we did for the day trade. But I think the option is a better thing to hold if you wanna hold something here. Um, or you can get out of the option today. A bunch of people emailed me. They got out of the option already today. That's fine. Um, what time did I send it out? I think Yeah, I did send this out in the pre-market. Let me just double check what time that was. I sent the option out. Again, most of the options trades I sent in the pre-market. Yeah, I sent it at 7.05 uh, a.m. <laughs> I like this this morning when I rolled out of bed. 7.05 a.m. I sent the 107 puts. Um... Yeah, that was really early today. <laughs> Anyways, this was a nice move. This was a stocks with show play of the day today. And again, I also called it a put in it. If I happen to call an option and a day trade in the same stock on the same day, you know that I love it. You absolutely know that I love it. And again, you don't have to do both. You could do one, you could do the other, uh, or you can do both. Um, but if I do call them both on the same day, you know I really, really love the gap, which I did in this today. This, this spike was crazy. I mean, unfortunately, it is what it is, and we did have to take a stop in the first trade, but I didn't give up on it. I didn't give up on it, so I'm giving myself a round of applause. I really did great with this today. Waited, was patient, hammered it, nailed it, called the market perfectly today, too. Here, this is continuing to drop. It's going to break 103. Show an hour left of the day. Sell off, big time sell off today for the market. Big time sell off here for Nike. We'll see where we go. If you're interested in signing up for the Golden Gap course, I'm doing a special for July 4th. It's called the Golden Gap Course Combo. Don't miss out. It's a great opportunity to be able to join and learn. And the class is at the end of July. But if you sign up now, you can start receiving the newsletters already and enter the trading room. And you would have been there today to get this. Have a great day, everyone. Email me at melissathestockswish.com for any questions.